The Metro already has pro baseball, hockey, and basketball, and soon we can add soccer to the list of sports. I'm Dan Winters. Thank you for being with us tonight. WHO 13's Taj Simmons joins us live now from the spot where the United Soccer League could soon have a new home. Well, Dan, the site where I'm standing it may not look like much now, but as the sign behind me says, this is where the dream of pro soccer in Iowa started, and this is where it's going to happen. The USL Championship League, which is one step below Major League Soccer, announced that an expansion team is coming right here when a stadium is built right on this plot. The man behind the plan says it's not just about the sports coming to Des Moines, it's about Des Moines itself being the Major League City. The USL Championship League has a Midwest-sized hole in its map, and the Soccer Association long believed Des Moines was the perfect city to fill that void. Iowa com could compete across the country uh, and, and be one of the top soccer states in, in, uh, in the United States. All they needed was a place to play. Kraus Group CEO Kyle Kraus soon spearheaded the pro-Iowa campaign, which focused on transforming the former Dyko site on the banks of the Raccoon River into a brand new $83 million stadium worthy of pro sports. It certainly feels good to have a super fun site go away and then it feels that much better to be able to put a beautiful stadium on top of it. After more than two years of planning, Kraus and the USL made their partnership official on Thursday. Iowa will soon have its pro soccer team. We'll start construction the fall of this year with the first kick being the spring of 2024. Kraus still owns the Des Moines Menace, the reigning champions of USL's League Two. Pro Iowa's planned team does not have a name yet, but Kraus suggests getting all of your Menace merchandise now. We won't call it the Des Moines Menace. That always exists, so I'll give you that as a teaser. Kraus and the USL say the new stadium is just as important as the new team. They believe it will prove Des Moines is on par with the other cities in the league, such as Phoenix and Tampa. The larger economic impact that uh, this stadium project will have uh, will benefit the entire community and, and, and the entire state. The countdown is on until kickoff, when this long vacant land becomes home to thousands of enthusiastic fans. It makes today just one of those really, you know, dream come true days. Now, as mentioned before, Kraus already owns Des Moines Menace, but he also owns Parma Calcio, which is a Italian soccer club in Serie A. So clearly he's used to the uh, odds and ends of soccer ownership. Now, going back to the stadium, as mentioned, it will cost $83 million. That's the estimate from Pro Iowa. But a lot of that funding is already accounted for. They've raised about $20 million in private donations, and they also got a grant for $23.5 million from the Iowa Economic Development Authority. So, Dan, as you said, this is a project that is going to take shape. It's no longer just a vision. It is going to become a reality sooner rather than later. It's incredible, and we all get to dream up what the name could be. Thank you. Tosh Simmons reporting live in downtown.